Uh, well, I've been here for the past year as the community development director for the city. Okay. And did the city council approach you to take over as a city administrator, or how did that all work out? Uh, yeah, I think that uh, when they took action and, and decided to move forward, they um, uh, needed somebody to fill the, the position, and, and uh, I was asked if, if I had an interest, and and uh, so I sat down and talked to them, and that's how it how it happened. <laughs> And um, there's talk now of making you making it a permanent position. I did have uh, a discussion with the city council, um, and I think that we've agreed that we'll go on and down that path. And and uh, I've met with the uh, negotiating committee that the council has, and I think we've worked everything out. And it just has to be fo uh, formalized at this point. But uh, there's just so many things going on that I, we just haven't had the chance to do that yet. So. And how exactly does that work? Does the city council appoint a city administrator? Yeah, that's that's the responsibility of the city council. City council, uh, with res with respect to employees of the city, uh, they are over three employees: the city administrator, the municipal judge, and the city attorney. The city administrator then is over the other employees with of the city. Are you from Canyon City? No, no. Where are you from originally? Uh, originally Illinois. I've been out in Colorado since about 82, 83 thereabouts. Uh, most of my time has been over on the West Slope. I was in Snowmass Village. Uh, I was a city planner in Snowmass Village for many years. Uh, I spent some time in Park City, Utah as a community development director over there. Um, I came back to Colorado then in 19... 2001 I guess it was when I came back and uh, managed a architecture and engineering uh, company uh, for several years and worked for the uh, city of Carbondale as a community development director. So sounds like you've been involved with community groups in one way or another for quite a long time. How, time. Did, how did you get involved in all of that? Well I, I uh, have a master's degree in city and regional planning. So get, getting out of graduate school, I've been working for cities and you know, organizations related to cities and city planning. And, and I've worked for uh, real estate developers for a number of years. So I've been around that for 30 years. How did you end up here in Canyon? Uh, I took a little bit of time off, went out to Illinois. My mother was in poor health at the time. Uh, so I went back there and spent several months um, kind of sitting at the nursing home most days. And uh, after about six months of that, then it was time to start looking for another job and moving on. And so I decided to come back to Colorado and uh, there was an opening here and sat down and talked to him. It seemed like a good community and a good fit. So it all worked out. 